everyone, today I'm going to teach you how to make the banchan or the side dish um, squid or ojinga. Ojinga? Ojinga. Ojinga. Te. Take two. Try to. Okay, take two. Now, again, ojinga te mochi. Ah, shucks. Anyway, this is a very, 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 very easy. Thing to do okay what are the ingredients we have squid you can buy this in different um, um weight I don't know but I don't know how much that milk grams okay then uh, almond mayonnaise sesame oil sesame seed corn starch I corn syrup sugar garlic and gochujang and gochukaru okay so and a little bit of water this is super easy i'm telling you anyone can do this all right now um first thing i didn't measure it prior because like i said this is something very easy so tancha tancha okay plus the fact that our ojingo is not that much therefore doesn't have to be too much. Okay. All right. First, of course, turn on your pan. The almond, by the way, is optional. If you don't have almond, it just okay. It doesn't matter. Okay, it doesn't have. It won't change the taste. It's just for more active people like me. the correct people <laughs> but it adds taste good all right now this one there's no procedure like which one first whatever comes it doesn't matter okay it's up to you so don't be like pressured which one to do water first i'll put water first and then i'm gonna put one third cup of gochujang Maybe not one third, too much that there is very little. Um, Jimmy Chick. little bit of garlic sesame oil <clears throat> it's the very first banchan I've learned to cook And then you put sugar. And you put corn syrup. Why do you have to pour, put corn syrup? Well, to balance the taste and also this will make your bun, I mean the squid shiny may isipan ko siyang lutuin because I wanna eat this for lunch so easy as in and then put this um, put a little bit of gochujang Kochukaru. Not too much, it will make it too spicy. Actually, 
actually that's it and then maybe a little bit more sugar babe i want a little bit too much already too much already i'm dead up there okay so basically that's it shake 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 all right that's it and then now we mix it can you move a little bit the camera my love now putting mayonnaise has been a new trend in korea to this banchan so a little bit only if you don't want the mayonnaise you don't have to but this actually will make your squid softer let me put on some gloves so that i can mix it properly I have become real ajuma. <laughs> become real Korean ajuma. Okay. Now, I cut this um, squid because they're too long, so it's easier to actually um, a little bit more. That's too little. That will actually also soften the taste. As you can see, you put a lot of those um, spices. So it's very, very spicy. But with this, it will soften the taste. All right, next, we're ready to put on this mixture. Ooh. Pour in your almond. Ooh. That's it. And then sesame seed. Put a little bit more of this as well. Because I like the smell of sesame oil. There you have it. Let me try. Mm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yummy. So yummy. Okay, bye. See you next time. Don't forget to subscribe.